Hi guys, it's Dan here, and today we're going to be talking about the importance of B-roll footage and how you can actually carry this out. So B-roll footage is actually footage that's captured of an element as opposed to a certain location or establishment, and an example of B-roll footage would be a close-up of a football pitch. An example of something that wouldn't be B-roll footage would be an actual shot of a stadium or the actual area surrounding it. This B-roll footage can actually be used on multiple videos easily and seamlessly whilst actually matching the video it's going on to. For example, if you're making a video of a football pitch and then make another video of a different football pitch, that close-up of the football pitch can be used easily. The key when actually filming B-roll footage is to ensure that you're using close-up shots that don't actually include the background of where you're at. Additionally, you want to make sure these shots are focused in well and you've got a steady hand when actually recording. This will ensure that the recordings you get for B-roll are able to be used on multiple videos all the time. Thanks a lot for watching guys, I hope this explains more about B-roll footage and I'll see you guys on the next one.